Welcome to an adventure motorcycle tour of Pakistan's most beautiful places. Good morning everyone from Mingora in Swat. Today the ride is going to take us from Mingora to Bahrain. I've been told Maidan or Median right below Bahrain is very picturesque. So the weather today looks pretty incredible. Looking forward to this ride. So yeah, get ready and we'll head up. Only my second time using couch surfing to stay with someone and I must say I was not disappointed. The very first one was years ago in Paris and he was an amazing guy as well. Might have to give it more chances. Hello. <laughs> The temperature is definitely way better than it was in Peshawar. Oh my god, it was so hot. Oh, look at those mountains in the back. We walked here last night actually, and all these hotels, they light up so nicely. And there's so many restaurants along this road. Apparently this city is very touristic, so it's one of the first places where you can see the hot weather from like Peshawar, Lahore, Islamabad. So a lot of Pakistanis try to escape the heat by coming here. And so they get all these hotels on this road and the river is on our left. So oh, they have a river nearby, restaurants, and hotels, and they escape the heat. We take a left here. Just a few minutes later, and man, the scenery is already looking great. There are so many hotels here. It's the entire street, just one hotel after another. Some of them are super nice too. Uh, just missed one, well I saw it, but missed recording it for you guys. Um, and of course they build them higher so you can see the river. This one probably has a beautiful view of the river. This is a cute little town. Very nice road. You never know what a driver's going to do in this country. <laughs> Everything here is normal. The police didn't try to stop me. <laughs> I don't think that was a checkpoint checkpoint. It was a pseudo checkpoint. <laughs> oh, I just saw some skiing signs. I guess they ski here. It's called Malam Jaba. is the name of the town we're at. We are winding up. I hope you guys can hear me with the motorbike. <laughs> well, not sure if you can see this, but I was supposed to go this way, and I went down up this road, which is beautiful. For, for the last 15 minutes, I've been on the wrong road, but uh, 
man is beautiful no worries beautiful ride I'm happy to do it again but hopefully not make a mistake this time <laughs> all right hour and 20 minutes to our destination I was so distracted by the beauty I forgot to check on the navigation see if I'm going the right way for the last 20 minutes This is the road I was supposed to take. Alright, let's get through this. Check to make sure you're still on the right road, and we are. <laughs> but that was one nice road that I made in place. I kind of hope that this road's as nice as the last one. Well, so far it's just been a city. So it's a bit warm, going to take a short water break. Beautiful day though, it looks hotter than it actually is. I mean it's still hot but compared to Peshawar, this is fantastic. Oh my god, Pizza Hut. I'm pretty sure it's not a real one but Pizza Hut. I stopped by to get some water and some snacks. I'm in the middle of nowhere. What city are we in now? Fazakhila. Oh my god. And this is the shopkeeper. Salam alaikum. Salam alaikum. And his English. <laughs> his English is great. But uh, he's wondering why I'm why I'm here in Pakistan. Because it's amazing. <laughs> I'm not sure why everyone speaks English. Why uh, do you speak English? A little bit I speak. A yes. little bit I speak. <laughs> but uh, it's it's so good for travelers like me and you if you come to Pakistan. So many Thank people you. here speak English and so friendly. So friendly. <laughs> Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you so much. Thank you. What is your name? Wakar Ahmad. Okay. Wa Wakar. Wakar. Wakar Ahmad. <laughs> Ahmad. 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 Wakar Ahmad. Wakar Ahmad. 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 Very nice to meet you. Your name? Raman. Raman. Yes. Good. Nice name. Thank you so much. If you're ever in Pakistan, you have to try these. They're so good. They're like butter, salty butter crisps. I don't know. So good. Oh yeah, it says crispiest and lightest. <laughs> <laughs> They're so good everywhere. Cheap and delicious. Mm. Such a pleasant guy. Again, in the middle of nowhere. Had some drinks, had some snacks. And now we head on out. situation, a lot of traffic. A lot of traffic.
we are in yet another little village. Well, maybe not so little. I kind of like this one, though. It's pretty cool. So many people, though. Wow. All right, let's get out of here. Well, I've been saying I like this village. This is actually Madian. The village or town just south of where we need to be. They said this would be cute. And it is, I like it. Very cool. Very chill. That's a cool uh, building there. Oh, there is bridge. Hey, this is nice. Very cool. Oh, Alright, gotta check the map now. <laughs> Very nice. Google says, Google says two minutes, so this, yeah, this has got to be Bahrain. So my last host recommended that I contact someone here in Bahrain who's also on Couchsurfing, and I did, and he was very welcoming. So somewhere here, I shall have to stop, find a shaded area, and contact him and see when he's available and uh, figure out what to do in Bahrain. I've arrived in Bahrain and contacted my host, told him my current location and waiting for him to come and find me. And uh, yeah, so weather's really good, found a nice shady spot and looking forward to exploring this place. Hello everyone, this is my contact and host in Bahrain, Bakhtu. Yes. So he has found me and now we're gonna follow him, I guess, to your place. Yeah. Uh, Beren, Swat, Beren village. Beren village, great. Nice to meet you. Yes, I most welcome my sweet dear Thank you. Uh, Raman from USA. Yes. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much. Alright, we're gonna head up. It's my friend hotel. It's your friend's hotel, yes. okay? I I I host any person my uh, friend hotel. Oh, okay. Two, three hotels in Bahrain. Oh, okay. And, and uh, for two hotels in, in Kalam. Oh, really? Yes. <laughs> Interesting. Very nice. Okay, Here? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yours okay? I have to. This your car? That's <laughs> yes, my friend car. Oh, nice. <laughs> yes, come to, come to the Gora. <laughs> okay, yeah, yeah. Well, uh, so, uh, my host, oh, there he is actually has brought me to his nephew's hotel and look at the size of this place it's enormous so he's hosting me at his nephew's hotel my room i believe is going to be this one named bluebell he's enjoying the view so speaking of the view let me show you guys the view here River. Apparently there's a hydro power dome down here somewhere. Beautiful. The hill. The sun is out. 
And now they've surprised me with chicken karahi. Looks delicious. And I believe it's the hotel restaurant makes this, right? And nothing like karahi, baby. Whew, nice. We're gonna enjoy. It's the evening time. My uh, local friend Baktu is taking me on a little walk in Bahrain. The weather right now is absolutely perfect. <laughs> uh, there's a lot of activity here. People are uh, hanging out. All kinds of stuff for sale. What is this? He's making eggs. Chicken corn soup. Chicken corn soup. Oh, chicken corn soup. Yes, I had this before last time I was in Pakistan. I feel like I'm the only foreigner in, in Bahrain. <laughs> yes. You think so? <laughs> it's a very touristic spot, but for Pakistani tourists. Yes. But I swear, I think I'm the only non-Pakistani right now in Bahrain. <laughs> And you guys know there's a country called Bahrain, but we're not in Bahrain country. We're in Bahrain city. <laughs> Lucky day, it's barbecue tonight. I'm, I'm guessing there's barbecue here every night. <laughs> it's a permanent sign. Really lit up place, cool. So I was told that trout fish is very popular here. And you could see like restaurants with fish signs see like this one how are you sir hello 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 <laughs> hello assalamu alaikum <laughs> and so there's a lot of restaurants that serve seafood grilled fish maybe we'll get to try it it's really chill right now actually but yeah cool atmosphere oh chapli kebab place <laughs> you can always see the the big oops sorry the big round grill with fire under it, it's always a sign for chocolate kebab. So also Bahrain is known for being Pashtu, similar to Peshawar, so like similar to Afghan, you know, similar people, culture, and uh, clothing, cuisine, hence the chocolate kebab. Wow, this street just keeps going. interesting hotel lighting <laughs> very cool oh my god this place it says dim sum yes. it's like asian <laughs> dim sum hotel. oh my god dim sum hotel i'm sure chinese people would love this place <laughs> we're, we're very smiley tonight some Bahrain. Wow. Hello, Assalamu alaikum. People smiling because they see the camera. <laughs> so many colorful hotels here. We are sitting by the Swat River, if you can hear it. And uh, this is uh, Liakat, friend. Um, we, I've been coming back to Bakhtu and uh, he owns a restaurant here, the open air, Aroma open air restaurant. The restaurant owner. Who is the restaurant owner? Who is the restaurant I'm owner? The... <laughs> he's, he's looking to eat in your Ah, your name is? Farooq. Farooq. Farooq Habib. Very nice. And by my surprise, food has arrived for me. Kabli Polo which I really like. I haven't had it in the return trip. It's a beautiful place. It's, when you walk down the street, you can't miss it because they've got these cool little like private areas by the river. It's, it's kind of like romantic almost. Private, family, but right now it's not super busy yet. So we're going to give this a try. Actually, why don't I share it with you, right? So, kabuli polo. It's got meat, rice, Special ingredients. I don't know how to make it, but I know how to eat it. <laughs> oh, it's nice and hot. Oh, wow. Mm. Oh, this is good. You should have some. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
random fun stuff going on today here in Bahrain. <laughs> Special heart for you, huh? Oh, okay. <laughs> wow, I thought we were just getting coffee, and, and this is oh, cool. They use uh, milk, milk, and then instant coffee, coffee and, and then cream. he steams it. Yeah. The man and steams it, <laughs> and then they put the cream on top. And there you go, that's what that is. Wow, very cool. Sugar, and of course, sugar. And they call this coffee. It's cool, it's like a latte. Oh wow, it's great. <laughs> this is Pakistani or what? I don't even know. <laughs> wow, it's so good. So normally how much is this? 150. Yeah, 150. So normally this is 150, which is like, I guess, in the US it'd be like 75 cents. For a latte with cream. Thank you so much. Okay. These guys are killing me today. Too much, too much goodness. I can't take this anymore. And they keep using the same excuse. You're our guest. I have to leave now. Well, everybody, today sure has been a lot of fun. The ride was great. The hosts here have been amazing. He's uh, had me meet a lot of people and they've uh, given me food, drinks, coffee, tea, everything, shown me around the town, and they've given me this uh, hotel room just to use. Uh, very nice people, above and beyond hospitality. Can't wait to see what else we'll discover in Swat, this side of Pakistan. Thanks again for watching, and uh, we'll see you guys on the next one.